Hey guys, it's Dawn. And Tyler. We're just out and about, and we are here at Universal Orlando at Cabana Bay. Yep. Um, we're actually getting ready to check out today, but um, I videoed the room the other night when we came in. We we're in a standard room, um, and we're actually, I'm going to put that in here and show you guys a little bit around the resort before we leave today. Um, try to walk down there and show you the pool, the, la uh, the lazy river. Yeah, because this is one of the this is the only Universal Orlando resort that's got the lazy river. Yeah. So um, we'll try to walk around outside just a little bit and show you that in the food court. And um, yeah, we got to go home after this. But um, anyway, be sure to um, like, comment, and subscribe. And like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. All right guys, so we are in the standard room for Cabana Bay. It's in the Americana building. Um, nothing here but the door. Come in, you got a closet, ironing board. Got the safe in there. The vanity. Regular bathroom in there with a tub shower combo. And we've got two queen beds. I think we've got a mini fridge down here. We do. Oh. Mini fridge down there and Several things of drawer space. We have not stayed in a room here before that has the circle window though. Okay, there we go. We have the view over here of Aventura. And the parking garage. We weren't really worried about the view this time just because we won't be in the room much and it's a short weekend but it's still a nice room have the coffee maker coffee supplies got your old timey alarm clock got several plug-ins and charging areas And that is it for the room. The last time we stayed here, we had the um, suite, the family suite. So again, this is just a standard two queen room. All right, let me start by showing you the view today because the other night when we got here, it was dark. So yeah. um, like I said, this is basically just a standard view room. We are basically here over uh, the Cabana Bay parking garage. And you can see Sapphire Falls over there, along with some of the Universal Orlando rides. You can see uh, Hogwarts right there. So it's really not a bad view. Um, we've got Aventura Hotel right there from where we were staying you come out and you have the view of uh, Volcano Bay over here now you can get Volcano Bay view rooms those towers 
The towers are basically brand new. They haven't been open that long. Not as long as the rest of the resort. And we see the pool and the Lazy River down there. All right, y'all, so we've made it outside. All we had to do from our room is just jump on the elevator right outside our door and spit you out, at the Lazy River. Spit you out right down here at the Lazy River in the pool. This is one pool that is here at Cabana Bay. They do have a beach area here where you can lay out, relax for the day when you're not at the parks. <laughs> We've got one of the pools right there. Cabana Bay is themed to be after your retro um, roadside motels. You got the Americana building, the Continental building. As I said before, they got the new towers on each end of the Americana and the Continental. We got a bar here. Yep, the Hideaway Bar and Grill. We have not eaten there. Eiders, we're getting past the Hideaway Bar and Grill. We are over here at the towers they do have a hot tub down here too there were some people in it so I didn't go video there got some people over here playing ping pong and right over there is Volcano Bay now Cabana Bay does have I know a walkway over to Volcano Bay since it's right here at the water park. So I know it's very easy access to get over there. All right, so we walked over here now to where you enter the Lazy River. And they do have rafts, but you do have to purchase them. Okay, there you go. All right, so we're now gonna leave this area and head through the lobby, show you the um, diner. And the bowling alley. Yep, the water slide and the gift shop. So, let's take off through here. We are here. Cabana Bay is a huge resort. So yeah, we've been showing you over here where the Continental and the Americana buildings branch out. 
from the center. And this now, one is the beach side, so if you want the right side of oh, the yeah, volcano, the, um, the beach side would be the one you would want to request. And if you want like the front side of the volcano bay, uh, bay side would be the one you want to request. And then now we're going to go see the starlight, the thunderbird, the castaway, and check out the pool over there. All right, y'all, so it's pretty busy in here because it's breakfast time, so I won't record a, month, a lot with everybody eating, but this is the dining area. Bayliner. Bayliner Diner. Now we're on the other side of the seating areas here walking around toward the lobby. There's the Bay Liner Diner where you actually go and get your food. We've got a couple little food, food options in there. Different areas you'd go to to order what you want to. So quick service. And of course, what would it be without a Starbucks? All right, we had a little gift shop down here. Universal gift shop. And we are around here to the lobby. And we do have this Swizzle Lounge over here. It's usually popping a little bit in the evenings. There's your check-in area. Once you come in. And this would be coming out to where the Starlight, the Thunderbird, and the Castaway. All right, so just to mention, the Thunderbird, the Castaway, and the Starlight buildings are your, I guess, really your um, standard motel type buildings. Where we are staying is, of course, on the, it has the inside corridors. And we got an atomic grill over here. Again, we have not eaten there. This pool does offer a water slide, which we've been on that water slide before a few years ago. It's pretty fast for it to be so short. Got the Atomic Tonic right beside the Atomic Grill. I guess for some drinks. Now we have not ever stayed in any of these buildings over here. Now I can tell you back there in the corner um, you can find the garden walk area to go to the parks. Um, the, it's about probably coming to Cabana Bay from City Walk. I would say it's about a 15 to 20 minute walk. All right, maybe we can see this one just a little bit better. Not over in the sun. But anyway, now we are here. It really is a beautiful courtyard area over here. 
Okay, I wanted to walk out here on the other side of the lobby just to show you where you would come in here at Cabana Bay and the check-in area. A little busy back there. It's about checkout time. So, we walk past there where you go in the lobby. I wanted to go right over here and at least show you where you would get on the bus. Catch the bus for transport to the parks. Their bus, bus service is great here. It does drop you off at the hub. But the experience we've had, the bus service is quick. We've never had to wait a long time here for buses to come back around to pick us up. And I always say it's maybe about a five minute ride to the park. And the buses to the park is right around here. They got some old cars out here for the whole 50s, 60s vibe. So we're gonna go back into the lobby right here. This will tell you about where the bus stop is. We're coming in right back at the food court. All right, so one more thing we wanted to show you. We have the Galaxy Bowl up here, which it's right up from the Starbucks where we showed you it was at. Okay, y'all. So up here is the Galaxy Bowl. And of course, what else would it be other than a bowling alley? It's got a little restaurant up here. we got to have a game room I'm not gonna walk all the way back in the back but gives you an idea of the game room we'll take a peek at the food court from up here where the bowling alley is so it's a pretty large food court pretty busy right now too all right, y'all, so that pretty much about does it for the walk around Cabana yeah, Bay. pretty much it. I don't think we missed a, a whole lot. I mean, I know I can tell you there's some fire pits. They have they have fire pits, I think, wrote, uh, do s'mores, yeah. offer s'mores. Um, they have movies. I yeah. think they show movies by the pool at some point. And um, some stuff like that that we wouldn't have shown, but... Pretty much that's the walk around. It's a nice resort. We do it, love Cabana Bay. Yeah, it's a nice value resort. Yeah. Uh, you can usually get this resort for a pretty good price, a pretty decent price, for staying on property at yeah. Universal Orlando. All right, so thanks for tagging along with us on this little resort tour, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye, guys.